The Taiwan External Trade Development Council, or TITRA, released a white paper Thursday on how Taiwan can rise to the challenge of global supply chain shifts. At a press conference, TITRA's chairman said Taiwan will need to deepen its cooperation with Washington if it hopes to strengthen its position as a global supplier. Speaking at the same event, U.S. de facto ambassador Brent Christensen reaffirmed Taiwan's importance to Washington as a like-minded economic partner. 请董事长慢慢地帮我们翻开这本书 Amid shifts in global supply chains, Taitra has released a white paper developed using feedback from 800 companies in Taiwan and abroad. At a press event on Thursday, the AIT director expressed support for the project, adding that the U.S. sees Taiwan as a trusted partner. The United States issued an executive order on supply chain resiliency. President Biden noted, building resilience will mean working more closely with our trusted friends and partners that share our values so that our supply chains cannot be used against us as leverage. Since Biden took office, the U.S. has pushed to reorient its supply chains in a partnership with its allies. Previously, the AIT issued a joint statement with TITRA on the issue of securing supply chains. On Thursday, TITRA said Biden's 2.3 trillion U.S. dollar infrastructure plan was a chance for Taiwan firms to cement a foothold in new U.S. supply chains. For example, right now there are 470,000 school buses in the U.S., and in the future they want to replace 20 percent of them with electric buses. That is a business opportunity to the tune of 100,000 buses. TITRA has already started discussing cooperation possibilities with domestic electric bus makers on this opportunity for electric buses in the U.S. Amid the pandemic, global supply chains have shifted substantially. Now, Taiwan is trying to work out ways to cooperate with the U.S. to secure opportunities to expand.